Hello everyone, I'm Sam, <laughs> one of the co-founders at uh, Tiger Motors. Um, there's, there's, you don't, don't know us, um, we're building the world's first production electric snowmobile. Our mission is really to accelerate sustainable access to the great outdoors. So we're starting with winter, but we want to go everywhere. Uh, we believe that if you're going outdoors and doing adventures, uh, outdoors sports, you should really be able to do it in a sustainable way, but also get all the fun and thrill that you would want out of any other vehicle. Uh, so why we started this company, we get asked this a lot. One of the main reasons is, well, obviously climate change, and it's a real impact, especially on winter sports. Uh, winter is slowly disappearing, so as someone who actually grew up here uh, skiing at Trauma, um, we really want to be able to conserve the, the amazing season that is winter. And the reality of current snowmobiles is uh, they're still very polluted. It's, it's pretty crazy when you think about it, but more than 60% of snowmobiles sold on the market today are two-stroke engines. Uh, two-stroke engines that can emit easily, even the modern ones, more than 50 cars on the road for one snowmobile. Uh, it seems weird that when we're able to launch electric cars into space with rockets, we can't make an electric snowmobile <laughs> at the same time. So that's kind of the, the angle we came from, is that we, we can do this better. Why, why is it that now in 2018, there's, there's no electric snowmobiles, why is no manufacturer working on them? Well, one of the main reasons is building a great electric snowmobile is, is a lot harder than building a great electric car. Uh, snowmobiles have to be extremely lightweight, they're high performance, it's minus 40, you go off cliffs, uh, you have to be really rugged, and you have to be pretty cost competitive. So these are all kind of the realities we were dealing with coming into the Tiger project. And the way we got around this was kind of taking that Tesla approach, where we said, we're gonna start from a clean sheet, we're gonna go A to Z, we're gonna design everything from scratch, so it's optimized. We're gonna get the lowest cost possible, we're gonna get the highest performance possible. Uh, this is where we're at. This is in June. This was our design right here. It's pretty nice. Um, uh, right here. And then, as it stands right now, we have 844 self-designed individual parts on our snowmobile. Um, there's over 3,000 total parts. There's over 100,000 lines of code running on this thing at all times. Uh, I, I want to say to the whole Tiger team, you've done some crazy stuff. I think we might be one of the most lean and fast development vehicle programs in, in the world. The tiny budget we ran on and the time frame we achieved is crazy. When you think about it, we, we made everything. We were going to see the snowmobile, but this is, this is our own chassis. This is our own suspension. We made the motor, we made the battery pack, we made the controller, we made the boards, the electronics, the body panels, everything. Really, every
Yeah, it's gonna start, the starting price for a snowmobile is gonna be 15,000 uh, US dollars. That's where we're starting off at. So pretty, pretty price competitive. I'm gonna go over some of the features that are kind of unique to the snowmobile. One, this, this is the first fully connected, really power sports vehicle ever. We're talking about, you got GPS, standard, your LTE connected, Bluetooth, Wi-Fi, you can, you can configure the whole thing on your, an app. If you want people to be able to drive faster, you want to restrict torque, uh, if you're a tour facility and you have more beginner users, no problem. Touch of a button is done. You want to get access to all your data, no problem. You can have that too. And what's really cool, uh, always we're going to be keeping these things up to date with automated software updates. So you buy a snowmobile and it's going to keep getting better year after year. Uh, obviously, great advantage of the electric powertrain. It's really simple, but it's really powerful. So you're talking about a motor connected through a, just a standard belt to the drive. Uh, there's no CVT, there's not a drop of oil in this entire snowmobile, no oil change, virtually a zero maintenance powertrain. So it'll be good for the life of the vehicle. Lightweight. Uh, we're talking about a, big, a, a snowmobile fully loaded that weighs around 500 pounds. Uh, so it, it's really competitive with the lightest two strokes out there. We have the same power weight ratios. Uh, if you start counting fuel, we're lighter. Range, we're sitting about 100 kilometers right now. We're pushing to keep improving this year after year with battery technology. But one of the great things we've achieved is range at really cold temperatures. Whereas a car could easily lose 30, 40% on a one charge at minus 30, we lose about 5% at minus 30. Charging, uh, we have a seven kilowatt standard charger. We have big plans for charging, but we also are gonna offer a DC fast charge option uh, where you can get eight to 80% 80 charge in 20 minutes. So that'll be great for anyone who wants to stop off for a quick coffee on a trail, get another 100 kilometers in. I don't know if you guys have noticed, there's something quite unique about the front <laughs> suspension on the snowmobile, whereas every other snowmobile currently on the industry has two shocks on the outside, one each side on the front. Ours only has one shock, which is inside the body panels in the middle. There's several benefits to this. One, it's more aerodynamic, you have less snow drag, and another big benefit of this is it really increases your stability. Uh, usually you have to compromise between being able to absorb bumps and having roll stiffness, but this way we can we can really carve at high speeds without lifting the outside ski. So one of the big problems with snow wheels is, is people rolling over. We found a way to address this. And then obviously the best thing about electric is, is the torque curves and how fast these things can accelerate. Uh, this one we're talking at maximum, we're looking at zero to 100 kilometers an hour in, in under three seconds if you can get the traction. So that's pretty wild on a snowmobile. Here's a torque curve of a standard combustion snowmobile. So you, you got nothing at, at low at revs, and you kind of come up peaking at like 100 new meters at high revs. This is, these are like nominal Torque curves, like the lowest power setting. Uh, you can go forever on this. 140 new meters, you're, you're, already, you're already way above that combustion line. Then, then you get up to the, the sport settings. You can peak out at 200 new meters. Now you're, you're really getting above there. And then we're going to be offering some like kind of crazy options um, uh, with some peak powers oh, way up here. <laughs> So the minimum is higher than the maximum of, of a combustion engine. That's the kind of stuff you can achieve with these electric snowmobiles. So that's that's pretty awesome. You can go anywhere you want with these torque curves just, just through your app. So you want to drive crazy, you, you can do it. All right, so that kind of wraps up the, the presentation. Uh, I'll go over the demo procedure. So uh, we've got some release waivers you have to sign <laughs> if you want to try a snowmobile. You're gonna sign it, hand it in, you're gonna sign a number, um, then we're gonna call people in batches. You can stay inside if you want. We have a bonfire set up outside 
right next to the staging area for the demo. Uh, there'll be a little trail. There'll be someone to instruct you on how to drive a snowmobile. It's very simple. It's like a normal snowmobile. They go up a little trail, come back down, and the next person will have a turn. Um, uh, you can stay here, enjoy cocktails, go outside. It's up to you. Uh, thanks, everyone, for making it. I hope you enjoyed the evening.